Street. Unknown if it's on over here. South on Ginger Street. Or South on South Park for Drive now across the Colorado. So continue. Still South on South Park for Drive. Still continuing southbound Dutch London Street now, still continuing. We're going to be crossing into the incorrect lane of travel now, so southbound. I want you to get the freeway. We're going to hit the freeway. User left to channel. Be southbound Dutch London Street still. User left this is going to come out onto Boy Low eventually. Have you got four in the line, right? Uh, I believe so, yeah. Okay, everyone else go for spikes. Don't try and join the line. Alright, again, this individual may be potentially armed at a bystander center. She was robbed by this car with the eastbound Dutch London Street, charged right now with a potential robbery and uh, a police officer. The, in the middle of the train tracks now, parallel to Roy Lowe's heading to the User Still joined continuing, he's going to be an incorrect line of travel. Now watch out, unit. Still incorrect line of travel. Coming up onto McDonald Street, he's going to be taking a northbound turn onto McDonald Street. We're going to be crossing over Brogue Avenue now. Still continuing now, crossing over Davis, still north on McDonald, watch out for traffic on the road. We're going to be coming up onto Strawberry Avenue now, taking a look on turn. Be in the incorrect line of travel, watch out for an SD unit. We're going to be taking a westbound turn on the Innocence Boulevard now, still continuing. Followed by a northbound turn on the Power Street. Still continuing, northbound Power, followed by a westbound turn on the Adams Apple Boulevard. Crossing over at Alta so Street. We'll attack one to spike, more than attack one to spikes. Alright, we're gonna be westbound uh, Adam's Apple now, taking a westbound turn into Calais, and then followed by a northbound or westbound turn back into Lindsay Circle. We're gonna be crossing over Palomino here. Watch out for traffic in the middle yep. guys. There's a lot of people. Yep, a lot of people. We're gonna be northbound Ginger Street. Watch out, unit. And we're gonna be eastbound on Vespucci. Followed by Southbound on Palomino. If a marked unit wants to take over, then they can. Uh, we're going to be westbound Lindsay Circus. He might be trying to pick up somebody. Stand by. Yep. Yeah. Keep the bridge coming. Alright, we're going to be crossing over the planches. It's going to come on to Decker Street. Stand by. Yep, unit is going to take over. We've got a marked unit up in the lane, it's going to be southbound back in towards Little Soul. Just to advise, there's heavy pedestrian traffic within this area, so keep speeds low. We need to see with another vehicle okay. in the street. The Hold a second, once again, the line is sufficient. Stop trying to join it and go for spikes. Continue up there. There is, we're northbound on Palomino Avenue, just passing in various parking lots, connecting on to San Andreas for the Little Soul. We'll be sticking southbound back towards the OTD. Instead of getting towards the LTD, once again, there's a lot of pedestrian traffic. Brake checking on the sun side of the LTD. Exiting back eastbound onto Palomino Avenue, northbound. Spikes, spikes, spikes. Northern side, spikes. Spikes, spikes may were hit. hit. Spikes were hit. Just be cautious, this is a very residential area. Well, it's it's be, so watch out for a bus. That's an apartment, follow him, follow him, follow him, straight in, quick, quick, quick. Don't then go, he's got, that's got side exits. Someone get the side exit and the garage right, exit. I'm, I'm going around the side. I'm going around on the western side, I can't get a white hoodie on. Alright, yep, he's in the parking lot, he's in the parking lot. He's the left or right? He's in the parking lot, I'll leave, he's at, back up the outside, by the LTD. I've frozen. He's biked where the car is. Where? The exit. Is here? Hit, 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 hit. He's there, he's there, he's, there. he's running, he's running, he's running. He's going he's up into the apartment complex turn. again. Back at the complex again. Someone head him off. Hello there, everybody, and welcome to another Let's Play here with the LSPD on GTA World. Uh, hope y'all are having a good afternoon, evening, or morning, whatever it is, uh, and whenever this is, when you guys are watching uh, that pursuit that I had clipped there. Uh, everybody's getting crashed when they exited the building, so by the time I get back in the game, which takes a few minutes and all that, they already have the guy rested and whatnot, so... Uh, Sadly, I didn't get to uh, record anything else for you guys as far as that scenario goes, although a few people did start trying to box in our cruisers that were, because there's a big gang hide note at the, the uh, Little Soul LTD. Uh, but so we all just kind of let the scene and let it calm down, because sometimes not interacting with them is sometimes the best way to soothe uh, certain situations and just let them calm back down. Uh, 
<coughs> just responded to a panic alarm there, but uh, it ended up being an admin situation on the way while I was in the middle of responding, so I just kind of pulled myself out of there because there's no point in sitting around for 20-30 minutes while a admin situation gets resolved when you haven't even been on the scene yet. So I'm uh, taking out the Scout today just because I haven't driven it in quite a long time just for something a little bit different for y'all because I think at this point you guys are all used to the uh, Interceptor and the Buffalo at this point so I decided to switch it up just a little bit. I apologize my throat's a little hoarse. I went for a run to, uh, today and the other day there. I'm not used to it as much as I used to be so um, yeah, I'm sure my voice bots sound a little scratchy compared to normal, so I do apologize for that. And, uh, yeah, happy summer, everybody. It looks like summer has came early here in Nova Scotia. Um, it's been warm weather all this past week, with the exception of today. It's a little cooler than normal, but uh, next week we're all in the 20-degree range, or I should say this week, because today is Sunday, and I should have this video up for you guys later today, assuming all goes well. Um, so like I said, guys, I hope you all have had good weeks and whatnot. Uh, I apologize that my video releases have been a little off compared to what they normally are, just because I've been heck... heck... Uh, held a lot of busy here recently. Um, next Saturday I'm doing a run Halifax, and then I'm taking my Ford Crown Victoria to a car show. I get invited to it, uh, so I'm taking the Crown Vic to a car show, so that'll be a lot of fun. Usually 50, 60 cars there uh, each, uh, every other week that we do it. So that, that'll be fun, and get to see some older style cars there, too. Um, so yeah, uh, not a whole lot here going on the GTA World area. Not a whole lot of updates. They do they get a new inventory system. I did go back to the old inventory system though just because it's easier for me to use so rather than bringing them up and dragging and dropping stuff. I'd rather just do the command based stuff than clicking the mouse and dragging and dropping but it is pretty uh, good the overall system and I'm sure those of you that play GTA World already know what I'm talking about when you do slash INV <coughs> which means slash inventory. Alright I'm gonna head there. All right, we're going to respond to that because it's a stolen vehicle. Let's just see exactly where he is. Form drive, but stolen. Uh, just going to mark it so that way I know exactly where it is. We're going to go code 3 until we get close. We're not going to go up that road because that's where that shooting was. And my game's going to crash here. Oh my god. Wow, this sucks. This server's been very unstable around Lindsay Circus and whatnot the last couple days. Oh, it didn't crash. Holy crap. Just everything is loading in at once and almost killed my game. Yeah, my game almost died there. The raid streamer is not good at all. Um... If anything, it's gotten a little bit worse as the uh, years have gone on. Alright, we're almost there. This might turn into a pursuit here. <laughs> oh, they're trying to inform them that the buffalo isn't likely isn't stolen. It's up for a test ride. <coughs> Oh, it got stolen from a dealership.
Alright, they're gonna upgrade this to a Charles. Alright, calling them backup units here. Oh shit. Show me in pursuit of a black and color stolen buffalo. We're going northbound on Davis Channel Avenue. Channel switched. User joined your channel. We're going to be westbound on Carson Avenue. User joined your channel. Vehicle's going to be occupied one time. The uh, passenger fled on foot. User joined your channel. Be northbound on Alter Street. User joined your channel. North on Alta just northbound. past San Andreas. Making an eastbound turn onto an integrity way. We going through the tunnel under pillbox. User joined your channel. Still eastbound on Integrity. Making a northbound turn through the alleyway off uh, Little Bighorn. Making a northbound User turn joined your channel. Center Street. In the westbound User Center joined Street. Your or channel. southbound, sorry. Passing Mission Road Station. Making a westbound turn onto Adams Apple. And South User joined your channel. Strawberry. Four units in line. Still traveling southbound on uh, Strawberry. Gonna be passing the LTD in two seconds. Oh, vehicle just TC'd. Uh, it's gonna be northbound on Carson Avenue. Making a westbound turn through the uh, Death Alley. Bikes on Innocence Boulevard going north. Uh, We're northbound on Forum Drive. Cutting through alleyway is still northbound. And we're on Forum Drive, correct lanes of travel, eastbound. Taking a southbound turn onto McDonald. I'm sorry, Davis. Hey, we have enough units in line. If you're not at first floor, go for spikes. We're gonna be on forum drive again, westbound. Northbound. Spike, 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 spike. User joined your channel. Spike successful, looks like. Negative spikes were not successful. Oh, uh, actually, right, why are they right? Spike successful. Alright, we're northbound strawberry. Transitioning onto Innocence Boulevard northbound. Uh, driver's gonna be swerving left and right. Westbound on Elgin. Or, I'm sorry, Adam's Apple. Southbound, Power Street. Gonna be southbound on Carson Avenue now. Cool. Taking a leftbound turn through an alleyway. Alright, so going through an alleyway now, we're going to be coming out onto Form Drive here and going towards Strawberry Avenue. We cancel out, he's going the other way, going through another alley, uh, parallel to Death Alley, coming out on Strawberry Avenue from Form Drive on Strawberry Avenue, currently heading eastbound, eastbound Strawberry Avenue. 
All right, standby. We're coming up past uh, Innocence Boulevard, still heading northbound on Strawberry Avenue. Going to be coming up towards Adams Apple Boulevard now. We're going to be taking a westbound turn onto Adams Apple Boulevard. Adams Apple Boulevard now. We're currently going westbound still, just past Elgin Ave. Now we're coming up uh, past Power Street on Adams Apple Boulevard. Still going on Adams Apple Boulevard. Now we're taking a southbound turn on the Alta Street, just under the Olympic Freeway. Southbound Alta, going to be coming up towards Innocence now. Carson Avenue now, it's Carson Avenue. Oops, suspect spinning out, suspect is TC'd. We're still parallel with Carson Ave. We're just going to skate park at Forum Drive, uh, heading eastbound. Oh. Actually, we're on foot and I'm running. Uh, suspect down. User left your channel. User left your channel. Scene static, we can clear. User left your channel. User left channel, channel switched. All right, this has been nuts. <laughs> that was a fun pursuit, though. All right, lots of units here. Holy crap, I didn't realize how many units were on the pursuit, but it was the stolen vehicle, so it's kind of get it now or you're never getting it again. Look at all the slick thoughts we got. We got one, two, three, four.
I don't even know how my uh, scout gets so many scratches on it. What the hell? I never hit nothing that I know of. Where, how, where'd the door go? The door never... Alright, something glitched. We're gonna be restream it. That should fix it. Do these cars not be restream? That's annoying, so you're gonna have to take it back and get it... Respawn it. That's gonna suck. I don't know how the door even fell off. It wasn't damaged at all. Alright, we're gonna get this guy uh, done up here and then uh, take him to jail. Well, no, I won't. Harold will be, though. So you always know it's a uh, metro interceptor usually because there's no push bar on the front and also no light bar. They run no push bar and slick tops. I ain't steal it isn't a name. Oh my god. Just did a quick NDC search for Harold there to see what the guy had for previous uh, assault and battery and government worker resisting arrest and driving without a license. Alright, we're already clear out from this scene and we're going to go um, respawn this car since uh, apparently it doesn't have a be restreamable to, uh, to allow us to... Uh, fix it on site, which sucks. That's annoying. The Taurus is like that too, or sorry, the Torrents is like that too, uh, where sometimes it'll break, you can't be restream it at all and not fix it. Like normally when you type in be restream, it'll fix the car for you. But on this one, it doesn't really have any extras, so I guess that doesn't happen. Which sucks, because like I said, I had no damage on that vehicle the whole pursuit, and now here we are. So we're going to go back to the station. Jane far away. That taken care of. I haven't driven a scout in a long, long time. It's been at least a month or two anyways. Just figured I'd drive it today just for something a little bit different for a change. Because the brakes on it definitely aren't as good as the Buffalo or Interceptor. That's for sure. He was behind the Buffalo there. and He was slaying the brakes. I'm like, oh god, I hope I'm going to stop in time. It felt like I was going to run into the poor guy. All right. Those are quite the rims on that uh, cruiser. Oh, he's swapping to a, a marked car now. Alright. There we go. Turn off the radio. There we go. I don't want a copyright strike. They're annoying to deal with because then you have to mute certain sections of your video and that's not a very good viewing experience for you guys. Alright, our car is fixed. Put ourselves clear in the system now so we can get back out there and do what we need to do which is go bust some traffic people because that's what I am, traffic division and that's what we do best. Sentinel going southeast, one grocery take it to tuck one. Channel User switch. joined your channel. User 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 joined your channel. Vehicles a red sentinel with a black top. We're now westbound on Dutch London. We'll be south of uh, Miss Bank Arena.
curving around it, going towards the helipads in La Puerta. Norbound on Dutch London now. We're Western Norbound on User uh, joined your channel. Right now. User left your going channel. Going VHQ. And I've lost VC. What's the vehicle? Uh, red, red Sentinel. Red Sentinel with a black top. It's a Cabrio, I think. Last known location? Uh, North Rock for drive. Going? Uh, northbound towards VHQ, roughly. User left your channel. It's clear tech initiating post User receiver. left channel Good switched. Um, you don't always catch them all. That's just one of those things. And that's one of the ones we ain't gonna catch today. Uh, Red Sentinel no plate, gonna be very hard to trace down with no plate and whatnot, because how do you prove it's the same Sentinel as uh, another one, right? So unless you have the plate and stuff, it's very hard to uh, trace it down, uh, unless the vehicle has like very clear markings and whatnot, but I highly doubt that a Sentinel did. Just the Red Sentinel, it's probably a bare basic one, and you're never gonna find it again, just gonna be honest. So like I said, some of them, you just gotta accept, you're not gonna catch them, you're not gonna catch everybody. Uh, honestly, if you guys don't know the ratio, we probably catch 70% of the people we chase. Um, and then there's always about 30% that seem to get away for whatever reason, whether it's super fast car, or they just have a lot of luck on their side. But I'd say, honestly, that's probably a fair ratio. I'd say about 70% get away. And then obviously some pursuits just because they're too dangerous to get terminated. But yeah, I figured that'd be a bit of an interesting, uh, fake stat, I'm going to call it, because I don't have the actual statistic number on it, but that's just in my experience what we do and don't catch. Alright, we're pulling this guy over for failing to uh, yield at the intersection. So, uh, we're going to go have a little chat with him and inform about the rule change, the law change there about a month ago. Alright, let's see what this person's got for previous. Now, if he's been warned before, we're going to uh, not be so nice. Alright, this guy has a holdout. I'm gonna talk to Ida here really quick. I never had to do this before. <laughs>
probably call a detective unit down here. All right. Not lots of units around here. If something goes bad, that's for sure. Hopefully I don't die. See, he's only wanted this to hold.
All right. Yeah, Camel and I'll screw this guy up if he tries anything. <laughs> we'll call SC down here. They need us to meet you late and we're calling them for that shit. Say if he has anything. Holy, they're flying. Tom 51 available airship mutual aid one please
All right, just waiting on. Uh, all right, they're gonna give SD a call, then go from there. All right, so it was a mix-up. Someone forgot to update his profile, evidently. So it sounds like he's gonna be free to go here in a minute. These are the kinds of things that can happen, though. It is what it is. It's a video game. We're all human, too. Alright, so of course that was a mix-up, guys. Anyways, I'm going to end the Let's Play here. It's definitely been an action-packed one. It's been the exact opposite of the last one, which is a good thing. Because the last one was a little boring, I won't lie to you. So thank you all so much for tuning in, and see you all for the next one.